I've come over to see my mate Jason, who lives in the suburbs here in beautiful, sunny Perth. He loves his garden and takes great pride in it. And I've brought something with me. I've got him a present that'll help make this area look that little bit more special. First job is to pull up these pavers to create a narrow garden bed. Wherever you've got a lawn and garden bed meeting like this, some form of edging makes maintenance easier and helps give definition. This is a steel edging. It's got a beautiful, earthy, rusty patina that's much in vogue in landscaping at the moment, and it's easy to install. OxyShield is made from durable, long-lasting steel similar to stainless. The rust look develops over time and is intentional, of course, and only on the surface, oxidising to form a protective coating resistant to corrosion and flaking. If you're wondering how the edging joins together, it's a simple but effective system. You just line up these lugs on one side with the holes of the other, bend them over with the screwdriver, job's done. I don't know about you, but this fence here looks a bit tired and a little bit nasty to me. Now, the OxyShield panels are perfect for this situation. They've got these really cool laser-cut designs, and they can be hung on a fence or a wall or on a frame like this that Jason's knocked together for me, and it's simple, just like hanging a picture. I'm going to put in some screws lined up with the holes, and on she goes. I'm going to do three as well. To complete the picture and finish off the makeover here at Jace's place, we've put in these tree ring podiums. Just over here, I've basically used it as a facade around an existing pot with the mango, but here, used it as an actual planter. Filled it with soil, planted the lamandras, given it some mulch, and washka! Have a look at that. I love it. Sensational.